Dorothy and her friends are still trying to escape from the underground kingdom of Gnomeland after breaking the Gnome King's spell and freeing the Prince of Ev. The Gnome King wants revenge, and so far they have survived becoming part of his ornament collection, being melted by hot lava and crushed by flying rocks. Now they're trying to reach the source of Gnomeland's only river in the hope that they will find a route to the surface and freedom. But the Gnome King is one step ahead of them. Oh, look, everyone. The river begins here. Now we have to look for a way up to the surface. It should be around here somewhere. Can you see anything? No, not yet, but we'll find it. Yes, and when we find it, I'll be able to go home at last. We will, too. I've missed the forest. I've missed everything up there. The sun, the trees, the birds. <laughs> I've even missed my sister Lulu. She's pretty silly with all her hats, but I'll see to it that she behaves. <gasps> According to my ticker, this is a statue. Uh, Here. Oh, thank you, Tin Man. Anyway, my ticker says it's daytime on the surface. Huh? Well, that's good, but don't get too excited, TikTok. We're not out of here yet. Well, then let's just get out of here. Come on! Right. Lead on, Dorothy. Hmm. Let's find that exit. Dorothy, be careful. You're not the only one in this part of Gnome Land. We've got him now, Calico, at last. Come on, you smart Alex, just a bit closer. Could be just around this bend. Right. <laughs> they're not just walking into my trap, they're running into it! Faster, you fools! I've waited long enough to pay you back for making a fool of me! <laughs> Keep coming, that's it! They're in range! Give them the ready signal! Yes, sir! <laughs> Now we'll set the fire. Get ready to open up when I give the signal. Right, sir. On the signal, but don't miss this time. Didn't think I'd let you leave without saying goodbye, did ya? Well, goodbye now. Not that any of you are going anywhere. This is the end of the road. Nastily put, sir. <laughs> you said it. Oh. 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 He brought the whole army. We're pinned down. Uh-huh. Well, he told us there's an exit here. But how do we get to it? Since they've been waiting for us a long time, they must have known this was the only way we could get out. <laughs> there, I see him behind that boulder! Fire and quit missing them all the time! Ah! 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 My ticker says it's 
hopeless if we stay here. We have to move. Uh -huh. It's just a matter of time here. But where do we go? Let's take a look. Look, a cave. Where? Over there. Oh, but it's too small for all of Over there, Tick Man, straight ahead of us. Oh, oh, yes, I see it now. Tigger says too far to run with a great danger of obliteration. <laughs> On the other hand, my Tigger says staying here means certain obliteration. That cave's starting to look pretty good. Right. We'll have to make a run for it. We have no choice. But we better organize this so our chances are the best possible. What's to organize? We just run like crazy. That cave's a long way off, though. They'll have plenty of time to, to take pot shots at us. You should go on Lion's Back. No, I'm a fast runner. I want to go on Lion's Back. What? And slow him down? What kind of prince are you? <laughs> We'll have to go now. They're pinpointing our position. I'll go first. I can hold them off if they come down after me. Good luck, Tin Man. Uh-uh. Did I say she's fire? Keep pouring it on, you makeup pump. Let him have it. Go on, finish him off. Ah. Hey! Look, the tin can's making a run for it. Blast him, now's your chance. Well, what are you waiting for? I said blast him, so blast him, you idiots. As soon as they reload, Manchester. What? Why didn't they reload before they decided to stop firing? Come on, hurry! Fire! Yes, sire, we haven't quite gotten the range, but we're getting closer every time. Oh, you're going to pay for this, Calico. Get down there and give him a hand. Go, Tick-Tock! Another one, I don't believe it, they're loony. Calico, your boys aren't moving fast enough. Another one's out there, fire! No, sire, we're doing our best. You're not! They're getting away! Fire! Understand it. We got him where we want him, and we still can't get him. Look, look at him go! Fire! Yay! Way to go, Lion! Scarecrow! Where's Scarecrow? Oh no! Oh, I'm waterlogged. I can hardly lift my legs to walk. I'll miss him a lot. Look! <gasps> oh! He's alive! He made it after all! Oh! Phew! <laughs> Scarecrow, you're all right! Uh-huh. A little flatter, Dorothy, but it squeezed all the water out. <laughs> Well, we did hit him, Your Majesty, a perfect bullseye. So what? You didn't stop him, and you missed all the others. Oh, well, no problem. Now they're trapped like rats in that cave. We have them at our mercy. Well, there's that, I suppose. Yeah, we've got them where we want them now. We'll get them once and for all. <laughs> We'll throw everything we've got at him, Calico. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> Catapult ready! Fire away! Boy, I sure hope they run out of rocks before they seal us in. They haven't stopped for a second, so we can't run for it. Ought to have known this cave was risky. I should have thought of this. <laughs> Very good. Just a couple more to go. Fire! Fire! Don't stop! Give it to us! Keep those rocks flying! sunshine too, but all this dry heat huh? doesn't oh. do a thing for my hair. Look at it. <laughs> <laughs> Think you'd better keep your hat on. Hey, you look even scarier than the gnome king. <laughs> <laughs> well, come on. I'm sorry I failed. I'm sorry I failed. I'm sorry I failed. Say it again. I'm sorry louder, I louder, I'm sorry louder, I louder, louder. Calico's not the only one who's suffering. The ship is farther away than they thought. But they reach it eventually. herself and moved to a chicken farm, Dorothy. I hope nothing terrible's happened. I wanted to say thank you to her. That egg she gave you saved us. Yes, it did. 
Let's all yell at once, okay? One, two, three, oh, Felina! Really? Yahoo! Yeah. Probably like me to put you down now, huh? Sure. Oof. You know something? I pooped. I think I'm gonna go home. Me too, Lion. I need a few days to rest up, get some sleep, do a little light thinking. Well, you'll be happy to know that my kicker senses no danger in any direction for weeks, so the trip home should be risk-free. Oh, good. Then I can go see Glinda and ask her to send me home. <sighs> I'm looking forward to going home too, Dorothy. I'm starting to worry about my wicked Lion. They're king, you know. to check on my subjects in the forest too as soon as I wake up. Dorothy, I'll keep you company on the trip to Glinda's, and on the way, we'll stop and tell Ozma the whole story. Must be nice to have somewhere to go! Oh well, that's the way the egg boils! Why don't you come home with TikTok and me? I'll make you my royal alarm clock, as long as you don't throw till noon, uh -huh. that is. <laughs> Look at that mess! I was hoping they'd be inside the thing, at least! Now, what am I supposed to do with an old ship? Uh, put it in a bottle, sire? Mm. Uh, sorry, sire. No, what, sire? Is there anything I can get you? My revenge! Huh? 
<laughs> Pack your pointy hat, Calico. <laughs> We're going to Oz. One adventure ends. Is another about to begin? Why is the Gnome King going to Oz? <laughs>